In this session, we will discuss about total internal reflection. By this experiment, we can explain the total internal reflection. In this experiment, take a beaker. This is a beaker. Yeah, this is a beaker and fill with water. We have to fill with water. Now hold the beaker above the eye level. Above the eye level. Hold the beaker above the eye level. Now observe the surface of the water. What do you observe? It looks like silverly. It looks like silverly. Why this, this is happened? What is the reason? Because this is phenomenon is total internal reflection. It is happened because of total internal reflection. Now we have to observe the total internal reflection. Consider a point O here. This is point O. From this point the ray OA this is OA strike the surface at this point and it passes normally it passes normally that is perpendicularly to the surface of water XY ok so this ray is called normal ray this ray is called normal ray next consider another point this is another point B. The ray OB passes in this way and strikes at B. Water surface at B. And what is dry and normal here? First, this is normal. And the point meets at point. The ray meets normal. Here the ray OB meets surface and B and now it gets refracted. Now it gets refracted that means it passes away from the normal. The ray passes away from the normal. This is normal. So this refracted ray away from the normal and here the incident angle is I1 with the refracted angle is R1. What is happening here? The OB ray is refracted here. The incident angle is I1 and refracted angle is R1. Next consider another point. A ray is strikes at water surface at C and it is away from the normal. This is normal. and the ray is away from the normal and it is refracted like this and it is away from the normal this is incident angle I2 this is refracted angle R2 next consider another point and draw a normal here and then take another ray It is incident angle is I3 and it is refracted that means away from the normal it passes away from the normal here the refracted angle is R3 what is observed observe here it is all rays all rays are meets the surface of water and they are traveling away from the normal and the angle of incidence is increases then the angle of refraction is also increases what is the what do you observe here and if, if the angle of increase angle of incidence is increases then the angle of refraction also increase here if this continues till a ray of light here take a ray of light here we have to take a ray of light from O that is 
OE. Take a ray of light. This is OD. This is OE. And it's refracted away from the normal. This ray also refracted away from the normal and parallel to the surface of water. It is moves parallel to the surface of water. This ray moves parallel to the surface of water and makes an angle 90 degrees with the normal. It is refracted angle here. The refracted angle is 90 degrees. And the incident angle, what is the, what about the incident angle here? This incident angle is called IC or critical angle or it is denoted as C. C or IC. Okay. So, when the critical angle, so when the ray meets the surface and it is moves parallel to the surface of water, that means parallel to the denser medium. That means makes and the refracted angle is 90 degrees with the normal. In this case, the incident angle is called critical angle. Critical angle. Okay. Critical angle IC and refracted angle R is equal to 90 degrees. Okay, so what is total internal reflection and if you increase the incident angle above the critical angle, now we have to increase the incident angle here. Now we have to increase the critical angle, increase the incident angle more than the critical angle, more than the critical angle. This is, this angle is greater than C, IC or IC. This angle, this incident angle is more than the critical angle. Then what happened? The ray doesn't passes through the rarer medium and it gets reflected. It gets reflected to the same medium. The incident ray OF, the incident ray OF reflected here the incident ray of is reflected to the same medium why it is happened the incident angle is more than the critical angle then the incident ray is refracted reflected to the same medium same denser medium that is water so what happened here it is reflection it satisfies the loss of reflection in this case the ray OF satisfies the loss of reflection. So it is called reflection. So the in this phenomenon is called total internal reflection. What is total internal reflection here? When you incident an ang incident a ray with the more than critical angle, then it gets reflected. That is called total internal reflection. What is the conditions of total internal reflection here? What are the main conditions? First one is the ray must be traveled from denser medium to rarer medium. The ray must be traveled from denser medium. This is denser medium. Say it is water and this is rarer medium. Say it is air. Rarer medium, medium is air and denser medium is water. In this case, in this total reflection, the light ray must be traveled from the denser medium to rarer medium and the angle of incidence must be greater than the critical angle travel from denser medium to medium and angle of incidence is greater than the critical angle then total internal reflection is happened okay what is the definition of total internal reflection? The definition of total internal reflection. The phenomenon, the phenomenon due to which a ray of light while traveling from an optically denser medium to an 
optically rarer medium gets reflected into same medium that is denser medium here it is water at the surface of separation is called total internal reflection okay what is the definition of total reflection the phenomenon due to which ray of light while traveling from denser medium to rarer medium gets reflected what is the main term it is get reflected it is reflected into the same medium that is same optically denser medium in this experiment the ray is reflected into water first the ray passes from water and it is reflected into the same medium so this is called total internal reflection okay thank you